The cold water flatfish is beloved in Taiwan for its succulent meat. Taiwan's temperate climate, however, is not suitable for flatfish cultivation, and Taiwan has historically relied on imports to meet demand. But that may soon change as the Fisheries Research Institute in Taidong has successfully cultivated local flatfish using various technologies to bend the environment to the fish's needs, such as lowering the temperature of the water. The flatfish are a lively species that love to leap out of the water, but cultivating this delicate fish in Taiwan is not as easy as it looks. Taiwan has a temperate climate. It's hard to breed cold water fish here, but by lowering the temperature of the water, the flatfish can naturally spawn in a more suitable temperature. Meat from flatfish is succulent and fatty, and is usually used in Japanese nigiri sushi. Taiwan has been getting its flatfish from imports totaling one billion NT dollars a year. But three years ago, the Fisheries Research Institute in Taidong imported a number of flatfish fry from South Korea, and through various techniques like lowering the temperature of the water, the institute has finally succeeded in cultivating adult flatfish domestically. Ah, this fish has grown to one kilogram. This species can grow to weigh one kilogram much faster than the normal group of fish. This means that the flatfish is a very competitive species. Our fish farming methods are mature as well. The Council of Agriculture will introduce these methods, together with this species, into Taiwanese fish farming. The techniques for cultivating flatfish are expected to be introduced to commercial fish farming in Taiwan within the next three years.